You remember when you were a kid, maybe in class, you went to the smartest person in the class, or maybe you were that person, and you'd ask them a question and they just know the answer. They were brilliant. Now, you have somebody that can be in your life 24-7 and tell you whatever you need. Better than a search engine, better than anything you've ever seen in your entire life, if you haven't seen it already. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to master ChatGPT. If you haven't heard about it, I'm excited to be the first to tell you about it. It's one of the most powerful AI. AI chatbots in the world. And I'm gonna show you how to use it, how to create amazing content, products and services that you can sell for a profit. 14 different businesses, but let's say you're not even interested in opening a business. You need to definitely get on board. So I'd suggest you watch this because it's an ultimate, simple, quick starter guide that I think you're gonna love. I think there's nothing more important right now to talk about than ChatGPT. And I'm gonna tell you, it is unbelievable. Welcome to the channel. I'm here here to share tips with you, figuring out how I can help you the best way I can to make money, leverage it, and using artificial intelligence is just a no-brainer. Let's be clear, the world has now changed forever as of November 30th. This video may blow your mind. My mind is blown each and every single day that I use this. I have spent hundreds and hundreds of hours on OpenAI, ChatGPT, and Bing after I got off the waiting list so that I could use it and see how these tools are gonna change forever and it is beyond my expectations and I've been around this for about two years my wife has a PhD in artificial intelligence so it's like in her wheelhouse I can't stop the experience of being superhuman like taking that pill in limitless with Bradley Cooper only this is better and has zero side effects and everyone has access to it so you're never gonna run out the common website that we have now probably is over especially when you see how this will give you the answer to most of what you want instantly. The idea of the search engine that Google came up with 20 years ago that's kind of simplified it for all of us, well, that is taking a huge turn. So it's going to be important that we understand how to use this stuff. The common tasks are over. Writing long emails to explain stuff, over. You want back half your day? Watch this video. You want to make more money? Watch it. And you want to make money? watch the video or you just want to learn how to be superhuman using this tool, please don't miss out on this video. Chat GPT is not going anywhere. How long it took for the top apps to hit 100 million monthly users? The cat's out of the bag or the rabbit is out of the hat. Two months for Chat GPT to reach 100 million. TikTok took nine months. Instagram took 30 months. Pinterest took 41. Spotify 55 months. It doesn't stop there. Bing then integrated it into their search engine and I'm going to cover that later. If you haven't heard about it, this is an amazing video, so please check it out. I don't want you to miss out. My name's Andrew Cartwright. I'm here to help you get money, leverage it, and invest it. And in this video, leverage your own personal skills with the best tool I've ever seen in my entire life. I can relate to where you are most likely. I don't care where you're at in life, whether you're broke and homeless or you're rich, it doesn't matter. I've been wealthy, multimillionaire, decamillionaire four times. Finally feel like I've locked in that long-term success. And since that's happened and the four times I figured a few things out, starting 32 companies in 40 years and 17 industries, I'm interested in working with you to partner partner on businesses in Epic 99 to buy businesses, successful businesses, integrate this AI technology into it. You'll own 81%, I'll own 19% because I'm not going to operate it. You're going to operate it. If you have good credit, a reasonable credit, and you have some experience to run the kind of company, I'm interested in partnering up with you. There's a form down below. If you just want a loan and you know about that side of me, please check out the 12 different programs I got with 80 different lenders in the description. You can see it there. It says loans. Hit that link and we'll get you the funds that you need for your business, whether it's credit line, merchant cash advance, whatever you need, check it out. Also, I got some free stock down there with Webull and also with Moomoo. Incredible stuff there. But before we get into that, please make sure to hit the subscribe button and the bell icon so that you never miss a video. And please like the video. It really helps out. Give me a thumbs up so it'll help out with the YouTube algorithm. What is ChatGPT? ChatGPT is an AI bot that can generate natural language responses based on user input your user input simple like talking to a buddy only if your buddy doesn't understand you now chat GPT won't so we're gonna get into that later it uses a deep learning model called chat GPT which stands for generative pre
pre-trained transformer. This model has been trained with billions of words from the internet and can produce coherent and relevant text and almost on any topic in seconds. Using every single thing out there, it produces it for you. ChatGPT is not just a simple chat box that can answer questions or have conversations. It can also write stories, full stories, poems, essays, code, like if you want to get computer code, you want to build an app, you want to build a website, it'll generate the code for you just by asking it. Lyrics to a song. You want some jokes, maybe not the best jokes, it'll write them. Slogans, if you're trying to come up with one and maybe you can't think of one. Headlines for maybe an article or summaries. Captions, subtitles, scripts, just about name it. It can translate text from one language to another in about 50 different languages. And it can rewrite that text in any style that you want and also any tone. If you want a certain tone, like an angry tone or a happy tone or a friendly tone, it can write it. Chapter T is like having a super smart assistant that can help you with writing tasks you need. And the best part is you can access ChatGPT for free using various tools that I'll show you. So how can you make money with ChatGPT? Well, there are are many ways to monetize your skills and creativity with this amazing technology. I'm going to cover some of the most common ones, 14 in fact. Number one, create videos using ChatGPT. You can combine ChatGPT with other technology to create videos that can sell and you can monetize them on platforms like YouTube, Facebook, Instagram, and now even as of today, Elon Musk announced that Twitter is going to be taking care of content creators as well. You can use ChatGPT to write a script for the video, which is great great. You can just input it in and have it write a script. You can use ChatGP2 to generate voiceovers for your video using text to speech tools. You can use ChatGPT to write captions or subtitles for your video in different languages. You can use ChatGPT to create thumbnails and titles for your videos using an image generator tool. Let me show you how easy it is to write a script. Just go right here. Write a YouTube script on making money with clay. You see what it's doing? Just within seconds with that prompt. Is that crazy? It's even got segments, right? Breaking it up, create and sell your clay creations, teach clay classes, selling clay supplies, right? And would you have thought of this stuff? Would you have come up with that as segments? Collaborate with other artists and brands if you want to do some brand integrations with it. And then a conclusion. So right here you have a script on how to create a clay business and make money with clay. That's simple, right? So that gives you an idea of how you can write a script. Now you cut and paste that, drop it somewhere so that you can read it, maybe memorize it, and then post it. The other thing you can do is copywriting services. A lot of people need this stuff. Do it for them. You can create ChatGPT written, engaging, and persuasive copy for lots of purposes, such as let's say somebody has a website that they need copy for and they can't think of what to say. You can take and grab somebody else's website and say, please rewrite this information so that it fits for the current website. You can do ads, write ads. You can do emails, social media posts, which are another thing, landing pages, sales pages. You can charge clients for copywriting skills and deliver high quality content faster and easier than ever before. There is a script that was just written in a couple seconds. We did that together, you and me. You can also write and self-publish books. The same way we did this, you can write a complete book. Take ChatGPT, write that ebook on any topic you want, do the whole book yourself, or use ChatGPT to help co-write the book with you. You can write a whole article and you can write a whole page and go, can you clean this up? Can you make it better? And it will do that. You can then publish your ebooks on platforms like Amazon, Kindle, Direct Publishing, or Smashwords and other places to earn royalties. I have a book that I published called Origin of Opportunity, it sells every single month. You can write your own own book, pop it up there and sell it. And now with Bing, you can even take and find sources for information you've written about that will back up what you're saying. Number four, offer translation services. You can take ChatGPT and translate text from one language completely to another, and you can use this tool to do that. If language is a barrier, 50 of those languages, you'll be able to connect the dots either way. Number five, you can either use this tool to help you with your own translation, or you can offer it as a service to others that may need translation or to do translation. You can charge per word if you want, which is a lot of times what they do, or you can do a project, whole project, depending on its complexity and quality of the translation. Like for example, I'd love to see my book in 50 languages. 
that's now possible. Do I have the time to do it all? I don't. I actually need that as a service for somebody to do. Number six, generate business names and slogan. You can use ChatGPT to come up with creative, catchy names, slogans, businesses, products, services, campaigns. And if you're selling any idea directly to clients or creating a website, you can do that and use ChatGPT to help you along the way. Kind of like your co-pilot or co-captain. You're still the captain, but you got a co-captain to help you out. Number seven, develop software solutions you can use with ChatGPT to write code for simple web tools or calculators that can sell and distribute online to people to use. Number eight, you can use ChatGPT as a, let's say a BMI calculator to check out people's body mass index, which is important if you're trying to stay healthy. You can create a calculator based on height and weight and all that to be able to figure that out and it'll do it for you. Then put it in an app or post it online and maybe if you collect somebody's email and their name, you can get a dollar for collecting their name and that simple calculator can create money by collecting email address. I didn't know if you knew that, but that's possible. Number nine, you can use ChatGPT to create passwords, really complicated passwords that are strong and secure for people. Again, maybe it's something that you collect an email address from. Number 10, you can use it to create quizzes for people to make it fun and be able to interact in puzzles for companies or for any type of game, maybe even game night, right? 11, create custom AI chatbot. Create a chatbot to customize chat for various purposes, such as like customer service or maybe marketing automation, lead generation, which is a big one right now. All you need to do is provide the necessary information of the business and let chat take over the rest. It's that simple. The mastery of this is really just asking. This is really asking you will receive. Number 12, you can use ChatGPT to create a chat box that answers common questions about your products and services. 13, you can use ChatGPT to create a chat box that collects feedback and from your customers, Maybe, you know, you're getting a lot of bad feedback. You don't want to be depressed. Let it handle collecting it. Number 14, you can use ChatGPT to create a chat bot that generates leads, sales for your business. These are some of the ways that you can use ChatGPT. And honestly, there are millions, if not billions of different ways that you can use this. And there's no limitation other than what you think is possible. When you're exploring these different tools, your skills, your interests, and your goals, it's all up to you. The main point to really think about this when you're considering it is that it's about your unique position in the world and how to apply the tool whatever it is you do it's just a tool as history has proven the right tool we can change the world if we put a tool in your hands like this what will you use it for but how do you master it how do you get started using this amazing technology how do you make sure that you get the best results possible when you're doing this that maybe you could have prompted more like this one well don't worry about that because i'll cover some of the common techniques that people use and how to use it effectively and show you how to access the various platforms online. ChatGPT is effective and it is unbelievable. It'll handle those tasks. So how do you master it? The best thing ever is to just easily use it. It's fluid. Practice is mastery. It's important to tweak the little and optimize the chats that you do and the parameters, the settings, and you'll get different results. The key is to communicate with it, to have a conversation. You wanna avoid major pitfalls or pitfalls errors using it by too long of a prompt. If you give it too long of a prompt, it can get confused. Also, when some people make statements thinking they're questions, you want to be clear, like ask it directly what you want. It can't read your mind. And if you don't like how it's saying, you could say, say this like it would be for a fifth grader or a third grader in the language that would be commonly understood. And you can change how the outcome is. And then what you want to do is check it because chat be cheap tea, it's improving, but but the output, the quality, the accuracy, it's important that you check and fact check what it puts out because guess what? It makes mistakes, it's not perfect yet. And most important, how do you monetize and maximize your skills when you're creating ChatGPT? So how do you find clients and customers who need your service or product? Pretty simple. One, you can create a website using some of the AI tools, post on Facebook, Instagram, you can use ChatGPT to ask it about creative posts that you can write, put up pictures, show on Facebook and Instagram, email to everybody you know that you wanna do it, send out a mailing list, or put yourself a picture and your information, what you're doing on Upwork, Upwork or freelance websites. Clients are literally limitless. You're handling taking something off of somebody's plate, you just happen to have superhuman abilities now. How do you price your work or negotiate a deal? Only you can answer that, what your time is really worth. 
Everybody has a different parameter. For me, when I'm starting any new venture and getting started to the first step, I think of the analogy of somebody that is like a hairdresser. If you have two appointments in a day for an hour and you're there and the appointments have four hour gaps, during those times, I walk outside and grab somebody that's walking around that looks like they need a haircut and I would sit them in the chair and I would give them the best cut they ever had, the best service, and I would do it for free and say, if you like what I did, here's a card. You're not obligated to come back, but if you'd like, here's my price, let them see. So my thought is work leads to work. Just as a contractor building and developing sites, the more I'm building, the more opportunities because people see that I'm doing stuff and the opportunities come. So how do you market yourself and your brand? Branding will be probably more on LinkedIn as maybe a pro, you wanna use hashtags to show people that you're using it and that you're actively doing it. Let's take a look at how you use ChatGPT. Now, first of all, you can access it several different ways. One is by simply going try on OpenAI. And I already had one open, but it'll have you log in. You'll log in to your particular email address and it'll pop in there. We have our clay idea. We were in another chat. So it already had it open in the background. Here's another place that you can get it over here in the, if you look over to the right hand corner there with ChatGPT, you will see I have an extension that you can get. There's an extension you can get, a Chrome extension. It's right here. You're going to click the Chrome extension and then you'll just add it here. There's even a video on how to do that. So that's one way that you can access ChatGPT. The other is right here by simply going to AI, going to chat, and then you're gonna log in. And then the third, and my favorite now, is Bing. Bing is right here. The way you get Bing is first, you're going to download Edge. You're probably gonna get on a waiting list to access Bing faster. Once you get on the waiting list, you'll see this code here. And once you're past that and they send you an email, you will be able to get it. It'll look like this. So you'll have search on one side and I can go Bing AI. And then what happens is it'll generate text on the side here. How do I fry chicken? We got all that. Now, if we want to go to chat, see the difference in search. Oh, it'll even, it's already doing it for me. So it's already generating a response. So Bing is, is working towards getting us away from, from Google doing that. So those are the three ways that you can simply access it. One is that you can access it through a regular website and go to AI. Second is you can download an extension on Chrome. And then third, you can simply get Bing and you'll be able to use it there. So it's that's pretty simple, right? About how to access it. Next, I'll put up how do you generate content ideas for ChatGPT, right? How do you create that? What I want to do is I'm going to write it right in there. How to generate content ideas with Chat. GPT. Just even generating content ideas, it'll tell me. Like, what can I do? Ask questions related to the topic. You can ask ChatGPT uh, a question related to topics and provide you the answer. This is generating content ideas can give you a starting point for research. Use a prompt that's at the bottom there, what I typed in. ChatGPT is a, a prompt. You input sentences, phrases, or and it'll generate responses that you can use for headline. Um, use the suggested suggestions, which it gives you suggestions as well, and to complete your conversation. So overall, you can use, look at this. Overall, ChatGPT can be a useful tool to generate content ideas, but it's important to keep in mind to suggest providing the generated by an algorithm and may not always be relevant. They keep saying that, and yes, it is true. It makes mistakes. So it has several things in how it it operates. So I think the bottom line in creating content is to help you create and engage in the content in a variety of purposes for different audiences. And ChatGPT has models and formats that can help produce stories, poems, essays, all those things. You can say, write it in an essay form, write it in a story form. It'll give you the output however you want it. And you can evaluate it by putting a thumbs up or a thumbs down based on what you think. And it is going to learn every time you show it what you want. It's an amazing platform. I would suggest that you get involved in it as much as possible. Start playing with it. Even if you don't have a plan to make money right now, I would get involved and start playing with it today. I think it's important that I wouldn't be doing this on my channel unless I thought it was probably the most important thing to be focused on at the current mo moment. Pretty soon you'll be deploying your own chat box for different platforms and you'll be integrating this into your emails and into your life. So my name is Andrew Cartwright.
Cartwright, thank you so much for watching. If you have questions or comments, please drop them in the comment section. Please like and subscribe to the video. Take care. Love you.